Hi, this is Raheem Zulfakar Ali from Excel Basement. In this video tutorial, we will explore one of the very awesome feature available now in Microsoft Excel Cloud. And uh, that is artificial intelligence turns your Excel examples into formulas. So let's get start. I will be explaining some different scenarios in this particular video with respect to te text, numbers, uh, dates and aggregation. There could be many more examples and I am predicting that in the next coming months, uh, definitely this AI feature will get more mature and will be able to create more complex formulas on different kind of situations automatically. So this particular feature is now available uh, all over the world. Previously, it was available in the USA region. So that is when you write some samples, what you are technically required from a data set. Uh, this particular feature that is AI will automatically suggest you some formulas and you can accept that. So let's look at some examples. The first example we have, we have some names and we want to extract first name, middle name and the last name. Okay. So now let's add the first name manually that is Raheem, then second name Salim. And as soon as I press enter, you can see here. It says fill cells with this formula. I can click on show formula and it will show me that formula which is being uh, basically made by the uh, Excel AI feature. Uh, if this is correct, I can click on apply or I can click on ignore if I don't want or I can give a feedback in terms of that uh, they can make their machine learning models or anything which is technically on the back end which is suggesting here uh, can improve in future. So what if this is correct? I can click on apply and that's it. Now you can see I have this formula applied by the system that is artificial intelligence itself. Now previously what happens, user needs to learn Microsoft Excel and then he needs to think a lot which takes time consuming activity to do it or to solve it now. But this particular feature is being awesome for novice users as well. They just need to pick the right initials that they want to extract kind of a data from uh, kind of a solution from the data. All right, so let's extract the middle name. So let me provide the patron Zulfikar. Then uh, we don't have the middle name for Salim Kanchwala. Uh, then we have Munir A dot Nizar. So A dot is the middle name. And now you can see that uh, it's just suggesting me a formula here uh, that is to extract the middle name from the names available. I can click on apply. Now you can see a value error because there is no middle name for Salim Kanchwala and Danish Ali. Now what you can do is you can enclose with an if error. So I can apply if error at the beginning and if value contains an error, keep it as blank. And that's it. My formula is being suggested by the AI, right? For the last name, let's say Ali Kanchwala Nizar and Ali Khan. Okay, that's it. Apply it and you can see uh, that has been created by the system within just a second. That's it. Super cool. Now let's look at the another example. We need to combine the first name and the last name. So let's put uh, one or two samples for the system. Raheem Ali, Salim Kanchwala and that's it. You can see the formula here. Click apply and your work has been done. So awesome, right? So AI uh, giving you a flexibility of doing work efficiently and in a minimum time. Now for the number. All right, let's look at the second example here. That is for the numbers. So we have different ages and we want to create a band for each of the age. So let's see how AI uh, can give us formula for that. So we will be putting a 55 year old person to 51 to 60, then 23 years old to 21 to 30. And see how good it is giving me a formula for that right and I click on apply and that's it awesome super awesome now you can think of that I mean for creating this kind of uh, of uh, solutions uh, and a formula will take a lot of time even you go to Google or chat GPT I mean uh, you need to uh, have a very several steps to doing it but within that application you have now this feature next is uh, we need to round the sales numbers okay so let's say we need to uh, round it to the next thousand value around it so that would be 35,000 this will be 24,000 this will be 56,000 and that's it 
show formula apply and this is the formula right next for the dates for example we have this january february and that's it apply and you have got the months right for q1 q1 q2 q2 and that's it you can see uh, quarters has automatically been extracted right see how easy it is just within one second you have extracted the quarter right we can extract the all right let's look at another feature uh, that is uh, let's suppose for the aggregations automatically it picks which kind of aggregation a user wants so we have a list of names for salesperson and three year sales and let's say if i write a name of an aggregation like max okay and when i press equal sign so as soon as i press equal sign it's suggesting me uh, that the user wants the max to be applied here okay now let's see what happens if I use here average instead of max if I want the average and when I press equal sign automatically the average is being predicted by this AI right super cool awesome so let's apply the average and let's copy paste so that's it uh, I have shown you some couple of examples with respect to formula numbers dates aggregations and that's how this AI is working very smartly in creating complex formulas in just seconds. Thank you.